the Hagee heritage with Shorthorns goes back a long, long ways because I, I know that my grandfather brought them from Illinois when he came to uh, Iowa over 100 years ago. Uh, but my grandfather and father were raising Shorthorns when I was born. And uh, I was very close to the, to the operation. I love being with them. Our time with Shorthorns was cut short because my dad became pretty successful in a couple of other businesses and the uh, Shorthorn business was so time consuming that uh, he dispersed those when I was a teenager. So we spent 25 or so years out of the Shorthorn business. When our youngest child decided that he was interested enough to show cattle, we, we bought a Shorthorn heifer along with a bunch of other breeds like you did in those days and uh, tried to make club calves. And, and we did, we were pretty successful at that through our son's showing career. When he decided he didn't want to show anymore, we decided that we wanted to just concentrate on the shorthorns and sold all of the other breeds. And so we've been raising shorthorns exclusively for probably 40 years. The name Cyclone Trace didn't just happen. First of all, it's a given, I'm an Iowa State Cyclone fan. So maybe that explains the, the cyclone, the tornado. But there is more to it than that. There's a golf course in Florida called uh, Eagle Trace, and I always thought that was the coolest name for an organization or a, a place. And, and, and I couldn't use Hawkeye Trace because of the fact that uh, I did not want to be associated with the Iowa Hawkeyes. So Cyclone Trace became a natural. It really was appropriate because many, many years ago, uh, a tornado hit just south of our home. It uh, twisted a bunch of buildings, took down a barn at, the, at, at a farm that we had just uh, a quarter of a mile away, and left a path of destruction and, and uh, unfortunately death all the way to uh, Belmont, Iowa. But it, it did leave a trace at, uh, at our home. Hence, trace of a tornado, trace of a cyclone, it fits. Cyclone Trace Cattle Company was a natural. In, in the beginning, you know, I think we struggled like, struggled like every other operation does, not really knowing our direction. And we went through a, a, a few herdsmen. Uh, we, uh, we tried to go the commercial route. We tried to go the show route. We tried to, to uh, beat everything to everybody. Uh, turns out, like I said, we were just a bunch of cowboys uh, raising pretty good cattle, but not really with, with much focus. When Pete Hunter came to me and said that he wanted to be part of the operation. That was the luckiest day of our shorthorn career because when Pete came to us, he brought not only Pete, but he brought Cindy, Sarah, and Ashley, and he brought Jess along. And they have really been, they were the shot in the arm that the operation needed. They understand the business. They knew the dir direction that we should be going, and uh, they helped me very much. The opportunity that John gave myself to be able to come work at Cyclone Trace was an incredible opportunity. One thing John has been has been a tremendous asset as in letting us do the things that we're able to do there. We've been able to create some amazing you know, cow families. We've been able to put together some programs that have really started to really work. As we move into the future with Cyclone Trace, I think the thing that we're always focusing on is one thing with John, he's always pushing us to be better and implement those new things. Um, that's one thing that they do with their ag equipment business and we have at Cyclone Trace is always try and move the program forward, always move the program in the right direction and not just stand still. 
Every year we have a, a production sale called Shorthorns Up Front. But there's a lot of production sales and, and we want to make it a, an event when you come to Shorthorns Up Front. You know, we're fighting some battles. We have it on a Friday night and that's not in a usual thing within the Shorthorn breed to have a, a production sale on Friday night. So we do some things that make, pe pe make people feel good about coming to, to the sale. And, and among those things uh, is the, uh, we have entertainment, uh, we have a, an extra special, uh, uh, we put a little effort, more effort in the meal. Uh, we uh, offer refreshments during the viewing of the cattle. Our uh, sale is on, on video screens. We do have the viewing of the animals prior to the sale. They're all displayed. I think very, very well, maybe better than anybody. I think, I like to think we do it better than anybody else. But the cattle are displayed before uh, the sale. Then we cross the street into the sale facility and it's clean, and it's warm or cool, depending upon the night. Uh, and uh, you uh, view the cattle on, on the video screen. We have gifts for everybody that buys. Everybody gets an exclusive Shorthorns Upfront uh, cap uh, it, when they make a purchase at uh, Shorthorns Upfront. Um, and we feature some specialty uh, beverages, adult beverages. Uh, the Triple Trace uh, and the, uh, uh, we're, we're kind of famous for our uh, Bloody Marys also. Um, but it's, it, you know, we, we try to create an atmosphere so people have a good time and feel relaxed. I think there's more business done after the sale than there was done during the sale, but uh, and, and, and that's what we're after. Seven years ago when, at Cyclone Trace, we started with a production sale, and at that point in time, we were selling cattle to people. As we evolved through that, we've tried to be more customer-based, customer-driven. Mr. Hagee is also in the sprayer business, and manufacturing ag equipment. They're very customer and family oriented and driven. And that's at Cyclone Trace is what we're trying to be is a, we're a family business that is customer driven. So we always keep in mind, we're trying to um, figure out what we can do to best serve the customer. At Cyclone Trace, we have implemented the junior incentive program that the exhibitors can go out and exhibit the, the females that they purchased from us and with those winnings, they will receive sale credit towards their purchases in the future with us. Also something else we've implemented was a bread heifer incentive program. Since we are going to be um, marketing our own cattle um, to the local restaurants and stores and that, we're gonna go ahead and use our own beef to go through those programs where the people that purchase females in our sale bred heifers, they can bring those calves back and receive a $1,500 credit towards the purchase of um, future females in the sale. As long as they bring back a wean calf that's vaccinated and healthy, um, they will receive that credit. Hagee Manufacturing Company is a, a, a short line manufacturer. We concentrate on, on basically one or two products and, and uh, and we work hard at it, and we're about as good, we're better than anybody at it. Uh, and so the analogy was drawn that Anheuser-Busch is the, the, the John Deere of the beer industry. You know, both companies are primarily responsible to stockholders. Both companies do great research, but they come up with a product, and then they tell us that that's the product that we want. Uh, and they spend lots of money doing that. Uh, there's also smaller beer companies uh, that uh, would relate to smaller manufacturers in the, in the egg equipment industry. But Higgy Manufacturing Company is more like the craft beer of the beer industry. We, uh, we, we concentrate on a, a singular product and make, the, and make the very best product that we can for a smaller market. And I kind of equate Cyclone Trace Cattle Company to that 
same uh, analogy or philosophy that you know we're not the biggest in in the shorthorn industry, but we work very hard on a focused market with a uh, with an excellent product uh, designed for a particular uh, special market within the shorthorn industry, and we do it. We want to do it better than anybody else, and we want to be special in that we don't just offer a product, but we service that product, we make that customer a part of the process. And that's kind of what the craft beer people do. So, Cyclone Trace is the craft beer of the short home breed. Mr. Hagee himself is um, one thing, it's very family driven, you know, family and family values come first. And they're in his agricultural equipment business and here at Cyclone Trace. I, I would like to have Cyclone Trace remembered as a class act that made a contribution to the shorthorn breed uh, through various avenues, including the show ring. One thing with John is his passion for shorthorn cattle is just amazing. He just, he loves the breed, he loves the people, and he's um, a man of his word. His integrity is first and foremost with what we do. Um, we stand behind the cattle that we sell. Um, we try and provide as much customer service as available. Um, all the animals that are sold, we back them 100%. Cyclone Trace gives me purpose at this time in my life.